coming up on our rather photogenic spot here. It's a beautiful area and I thought I'd get a shot of what I look like. And um, yeah, here's our spot behind me, back there. Here we are, starting our night, night hike, moving up the trail, hopefully everything goes well. It is a very clear night at the sunset, not so clear up on top of the mountain, still a little bit cloudy. Hopefully get some good shots with this setup. Got the light shining. Video on. Uh, see how this comes out on film. Got a couple of beady eyes from some some deer. Right up here, came off the trail right as soon as I shut the camera off, so pretty cool. All right, <laughs> it's pretty neat. I don't know how well you can see out there. Thought I'd get a shot of the lights down on the Gallatin Valley. Looks absolutely beautiful. Received a lot of snow, all these deer tracks. Everything's been snow covered a lot more. So we've got packed down trail, but it's definitely, definitely going to be a lot snowier once we get up top. Wind's already blowing a little bit, so it's, it's definitely cold too. A lot of deer up here. Amazing what you see at night. Made it to our camping spot. As you can see, same clearing. All the lights of the Galton Valley, Bozeman, and Belgrade, and stretching out there. And as we make it up here, looks like oh, about six to ten deer beat us to our spot. So they approve of it. I guess it can't be that bad. We're gonna walk down here and view this point. You can see the snow. Lots of fresh snow. We'll have uh, plenty to boil for water. Those deer have a better idea. They're up a little bit higher. I just don't want to go down in the valley where the cold air can sink in, so I'm going to set up camp and I'll get back to you. Here's what we found. It's an old bed, or 
something of the sort deer have used. We've hollowed it out, kicked most of the snow aside. Alright. And here we are. All settled in for the night. It's not what I hoped. I was uh, hoping for a little bit better a little bit better ability to set up this tarp and I think I've discovered that tarp tarp camping is not for me in the winter but that's all right we're cozy I'm warm just trying to get the fingertips a little bit warm so I'm gonna shut the video down and get back under the uh, covers as you can see I'm utilizing my sleep system and uh, I kid you not it's it's toasty so big bonus here to have this uh, the right gear for sure it's uh, it's definitely chilly up top a lot of moisture in the air so it's been very cold cold hike and everything so we'll see um, see how everything goes it's a little cozy nook right here just off the ridge line protected from the wind and uh, yeah, well We'll see how she goes, and uh, let you know in the morning. Good night. Armchair Outdoors presents Packing up early because you have a broken heater at home and you don't want your pipes to freeze. So it's just before 7 a.m. This is where I slept. Walked halfway down the side of the slope off the ridge line and effectively found a deer bed or elk bed that was fairly flat. Well, we're gonna make our way up top now. Well, oh, that's good camera work too. Let me tell you what. And there's what we have to look at. Through the trees stop this ridge line sleepy valley just waking up and last night later on we got to enjoy a beautiful moon I oh, my fingers are freezing So, it's time to head in. While the sun goes round, I'll still be found following. There's some deer that have come and crossed the trail there. As it winds our way back down to home. When the world goes drifting back to bed Memories in my head Wonders follow me
hike this trail all the time and this dog is always here. Seems to like sitting here and just greeting the passerbys. Hi puppy! Yeah, there's a puppy dog. Hi puppy! You having a good day? Huh? You having a good day? Come here. Yeah. Oh, yes, you puppy dog. Yeah. Yep. Seems to be the resident puppy dog here on the M. Yeah. Oh, stop petting. I'm sorry. I stopped petting. Yeah. Yeah. You say hi to Armchair Outdoors? All right. Keep watch, little one. Good job.